Breathtaking beast. I can't. My hunger is too strong. But I'd suck my own blood before hurting you. Because love. Ah, <sighs> Dracula is so romantic. <laughs> I mean, I'm watching this predictable tripe for uh, research. <laughs> Spilled popcorn? Allow me. Go go gadget cushion grabbers. <laughs> Chief Quinley. Gadget, this is no time for sitting around. You have a mission. We have reason to believe Mad is headed to Transylvania. Transylvania? I've always dreamed of buying a vacation home there. Dr. Claw is searching for the secret of immortality, rumored to be hidden in Dracula's tomb. If he finds it, Mad will operate forever. Your mission, find the tomb and stop Mad. This message will self-destruct. I mean, this will be important for that vampire research I mentioned earlier. <laughs> well, get to it, Gadget. Were you paying attention? On it, Chief. To Transylvania to find the secret of immortality. Which is obviously a figurative way of saying making unforgettable memories at a new vacation home. Oh. No, I don't want your blood. All I want is... Your heart! I have so many feels right now. I thought vampires were supposed to suck blood, not just plain suck. It sucks just fine. Besides, it's research for Matt's newest plan. <clears throat> uh, you know vampires aren't real. Vampires are real. They live forever, and so does their love. Once I have the secret of their immortality, I'll outlive all my foes. Now go and bring me eternal life. I know vampires aren't real, because if something could live forever, they'd find time to clean. Ah! Why have you come, little boy? <laughs> Who are you? I am the Countess Disembolsi, protector of Dracula's doom. And you must be... Yes! Yeah, Vinny, this! Huh? <laughs> Popular lady, so I'll just be going. You will be going? Down! Yeah! Eat carefully, Night Terror. Uh, what's a Night Terror? Wait and find out. <laughs> this place gives me the shivers. Yes, shivers. Of excitement. I only hope this vacation home's got a hot tub to soak them away. Ah! Rain, don't be so eager. If she knows we're interested, she'll jack up the price. Hello, you must be... Countess Disembolstein. Countess must be Transylvanian for real estate agent. Hello, real estate agent Disembolstein. Disembolstein! <laughs> what brings you here? Just an unconventional family who may be in the market for a vacation rental. Of course! Come in and stay a while. Stay forever. If the price is right. See, Brain? That's how you bargain. Okay, let's talk business. Who was the previous tenant? The previous tenant was the undying, evil Count Dracula! And did he install a hot tub? Hold your questions until your end. I mean, mm, the end of the tour of your final resting place. I could finally get some rest in this place. Good selling point. Brain, you keep an eye on Uncle Gadget. I'm going to find the tomb. <laughs> what is that? It's coming from right under me. <gasps> Talon! <gasps> if Mad wanted to find Dracula's tomb, they should have sent Mad Cat. Not Scary Cat. Scared? Ha! Me? You're the one scared of being trapped in this dungeon. 
Except I'm not trapped in the dungeon. <laughs> Thanks a lot. <laughs> what was that? The Countess said it's the night terror. <laughs> I don't know what that is, but I'm gonna go out on a limb and assume it's the worst thing ever. I'm out of here. I'm totally not because I'm scared. Me too. Same non-reason. <laughs> I'm going to show you a room that will make your head roll. Wowzers, you didn't tell me this vacation home has its own gym. <gasps> and a massage table. This will definitely help with my stiff neck. Yes, you won't feel your neck at all, because you will be a stiff. And it doubles as a bench press? You're right, Brain. I'm getting overexcited. The gym's adequate, but I'm still not sold. On with the tour. I doubt! Can't see doubt! A thing! Ouch! I can, and the view is great! Ouch! Yeah, keep laughing. I want the night terror to home in on it. <gasps> Scared? Oh, but you're about to be. And for the record, I'm not running in terror. I just need some cardio. <laughs> Prepare to be severed. I mean, served. <laughs> Pointing out the place's flaws. Good thinking, Brain. This dining room could use a lot of work. Go, go, gadget carpentry set. <laughs> No more fun again! You're right. We should get down to business soon. Huh? Last one to Dracula's tomb is a hot meal for the night terror! A spineless wuss like you is never gonna beat me to. My love. Oh! You know, Pen, fair is fair. You did beat me to the tomb, so you should get eaten first. You chicken! Better to be a chicken than get eaten like one. <sighs> it's just a statue. But that is it. Aww. Wait, Night Terror's a dog? You were afraid of a little witty dog. Hey, I wasn't scared. I'm just allergic. Achoo, achoo. I'm not afraid of anything, Penny. Especially not... Uncle Gadget? This room will be the last thing you will see! I couldn't agree more. I've seen enough. And we'll take the place. Go, go, gadget, checkbook. Who has a vote in me? <laughs> Wait, so vampires are real, real? Yeah, not nearly as hunky as pop culture has led me to believe. Young girl, I was quite a looker in my day. <gasps> Previous tenant Dracula still lives here? I have a no roommate policy, real estate agent Dismeow Cat Thunder Sounds. Looks like we'll have to find a vacation home elsewhere. Go, go, gadget real estate guy. Nice work, gadget. Mad won't dare return to Dracula's castle again. And neither will we. It's too bad real estate agent Disembowelstein was so bad at her job. I believe that's Disembowelstein. But no matter. How about we celebrate with a showing of Dracula 3, Two Fangs, One Heart? On me. I've had enough of vampires for a while. Besides, there's a new werewolf series with this super cute... <laughs> uh, for research, brain. <clears throat> for research. Vampires! No vampires! Exactly. 
Who needs to watch vampire movies when I've got something better? Watching Talon Cower. This is so good. <laughs> I allowed those fools to disturb your slumber, my love. You need your sleep, you beautiful vampire. At least they didn't discover the secret to our immortality. Beet juice! <laughs> I'm sick of being foiled by HQ. It's time to foil HQ with sick. You're destroying HQ with a tiny amount of liquid? Brilliant. Fool! It's a weaponized head cold zombie virus. It will transform the HQ agents into mindless snot bags. Speaking of snot bags, what's with Mad Cat? She looks slightly more disgusting than usual. I let her incubate the super virus in her nose. Huh, <laughs> glad you're finally putting that evil medical degree to use. Yeah. Soon everyone, and especially Mother, will see I'm the most evil health professional in the world. <laughs> Gesundheit, now go to HQ, release the virus, and turn those mindless zombies into even more mindless zombies. Whoa! Um, shouldn't I take some precautions? A, a hazmat suit? Ah, you'll be fine. Trust me, I'm a doctor. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Brain? That's pain power piquant pepper paste. It registers two million on the ouchy tongue scale. <laughs> Stop being stubborn. Wash it down. Penny, you know better than to share drinks, especially with germ-ridden dogs like Brain. It's cold and flu season, and everyone needs to be on their guard. Go, go, gadget, homespun disinfectant. <laughs> now that the table's officially germ free, what's for lunch? A serious helping of mission. Hiya, lunch lady Dolores. Gadget, it's me, Chief Quimby. Dolores called in sick. I'm taking her place until her replacement arrives. We believe MAD has developed a virus that causes congestion, brain fog, and acute zombification. Our intel indicates it spreads like the common cold. Your mission? Sterilize MAD's plan before it contaminates us all. This message will self-destruct. It's horrible! And gross. Like, really, really horribly gross. Not to worry, Chief. I know every home remedy in the book. Specifically this book. Old Ant Gadgets, ye old home remedies. No sneeze, sniffle, snort, or hork can stop Inspector Gadget from keeping HQ as healthy as I am. We might need something a little more modern when it comes to biological warfare, Uncle Gadget. Nonsense, Penny. Every cure we need from dog pox to bicycle face is in old Auntie Gadget's book. That may be, but why don't you go to Von Slickstein's lab for a virus briefing? On a cheap. Oops, almost forgot. Go, go, Gadget, wet wipe. Don't worry, Chief. It can't hurt you now. It's germ-free. So, how do you want me to get this virus into HQ? The vents, the water supply, the mailbox... Infect yourself and start licking. Gross! I am not doing that. Mad Cat would. If you can come up with a better way, do it. But do it now. HQ's lunch lady. <laughs> Today's lunch special is the end of the world with a side of zombification. Ah, why bother with all this scientific jumbo mumbo? Old Anti Gadget's remedies are proven to work. I've been wearing her anti pox pendant for years and have never caught the Black Death. Not even once. That's actually thanks to the cutting-edge technology. And scientists like me. Discovering a viral vaccine has been a dream of mine since I was a little girl. To think I could be just like Marie Curie. You know she constantly suffered from severe radiation poisoning? Science! According to Old Auntie Gadget, the best cure for any cold-like virus is orange juice, chicken soup, and hopping on one foot with your eyes closed while reciting the alphabet with a dog on your head. A, B, C? I'm healthy as a horse!
It's fine, Penny. I'm so close to a cure, I don't need half this kit. Because I'm pretty sure the last ingredient is... Huh? Attention, all agents! We are now serving burritos in the lunchroom! <laughs> That'll serve them. I, I mean, I will serve them, meaning the burritos, because I am the lunch lady. <laughs> burritos! No! They might not leave any for me. But, Professor, the cure! Burritos! Ah. <laughs> I've never felt better. Great. Stay with Uncle Gadget and get ready to start the HQ lockdown sequence in case Mad breaks in. I'm gonna get Von Slick back here and find out what the last ingredient is. <laughs> Burritos! Come and get them! Extra hot with a side of cold! Do not eat that! <laughs> I call dibsies on this one. <laughs> yes! <laughs> and they call me the sicko. <laughs> Talon, I knew something was making me ill. Well, you're about to feel a lot worse. <laughs> Lockdown button accessed. You know what old Uncle Gadget said? To get rid of the dizzies, dance with your eyes closed. Huh? Save it. I only spared you so there'd be one less zombie. <laughs> Admit it. You couldn't stand to see this face turned into that. Yeah! I need to get back to the lab and find the last ingredient for the cure. Ooh, maybe it'll be published in an academic journal. Whatever, nerd! Just unlock the door! Don't be green with envy, Penny. You'll be a viral sensation. <laughs> get it? Bowsers, I warned them it was cold and flu season. There's only one thing left to do. <laughs> Bust out some of old Auntie Gadget's home remedies and let our patients in. <laughs> okay, Brain, if you insist, you can be my nurse. Gadget's homespun cold and flu clinic is open. What ails you? Nova Magic Examination Table. Boxers, you sound terrible. Let's take a look. Go, go, gadget tongue depressor. Hmm, your mouth looks exactly what I imagined the inside of a ceiling would look like. I'm stuck in HQ. It's a lockdown. That's terrible. I know. Save me. Save you? No. Figure a way out, then infect yourself and spread the germs. Ah! Yeah! Oh, God! You're running the wrong way! How silly of me. After you. <laughs> okay, show me how to get out of here. Yeah, right. No one's getting out until I find a cure. Ah! Hate to leave you in the cold. What do you think you're doing? Ah! I don't know what's worse. Zombie germs are yours! Well, I think I've seen enough. Bowsers, ah! all these agents are under the weather? It's an epidemic! No brain, it's my duty as a self-certified healthcare worker to treat everyone, no matter how ill. Go, go, gadget, stethoscope! Welcome to my clinic, Penny and Penny's friend. Are you feeling sick, too? Distract the zombies. I'm gonna find the cure. It's no use. The last ingredient could be anything. I feel sick. In that case, I'm gone. Toodles! There's gotta be a way! Don't worry, Penny's friend. Old Auntie Gadget's already got the best cure for a cold. Orange juice, 
chicken soup and hopping on one foot with your eyes closed while reciting the alphabet with a dog on your head. Ah! Let me show you how it's done. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Science triumphs once again. <sighs> The vitamin C in the oranges and the amino acids from the chicken stock must fight off the virus. Old Auntie Gadget's homespun cures work. And I have just the way to spread it around. <laughs> you know what they say, starve a fever, feed a zombie. Uh-oh. You save the day again, Gadget. It's what healthcare providers do, Chief. You healed me again, Talon. Time to take your medicine. Next time, Gadget. Next time. <laughs>